Welcome to this week's show. We start with the many facets and secrets of crystals, fossilized minerals that hold energy and have many healing properties. Israeli artist and sculptor Chen Winkler is adding his own magical touch to ancient crystals and is displaying his creations in his showroom here on the Jaffa port. Here's more in my next report. <laughs> I prefer to listen, really listen to the stones. Uh, they are telling me stories, uh, they are telling me secrets. They say a picture is worth a thousand words, but a crystal carries secrets and holds energy that is thousands, if not millions of years old. It's a Picasso Jasper and, and the nature make all the work. I only try not to make a damage. We can see uh, a tiger eye. So I walk the same way that people walked thousand years ago on it. And uh, for me, it's exciting. Artist and sculptor Chen Winkler has been using his hands his entire life. The ninth generation Israeli comes from a long line of stonemasons. My father walked with uh, the stones and my grandfather, I remember uh, my grandfather working in his uh, sculpture uh, workshop. The legend in my family says that um, I was uh, sculpting uh, before I was writing. Chen is known around Israel for his 200 monumental sculptures that beautify neighborhoods and outdoor spaces. And I bring my children and I tell them that we are now touching in the history. And after it, many years from now, you will tell your grandchildren that you will help your father to build this sculpture. But these days, he's channeling his energy and passion into detailed and intricate crystal sculptures. You can see here the black diamonds over here, and you can see the pieces of the wood become a stone. This sculpture is called The Giving Tree, named after the famous children's book. It's made from a fossil that is more than 70 million years old. I bought this piece from uh, Indonesia, this wow. piece. Uh, I have also fossils uh, from Morocco and uh, uh, from Bangladesh and from Egypt. All the materials, that are, it's from the nature. And it's like the nature give me and I want to give him back. And if I want to give him back, I want that people will uh, keep the forest, keep the tree. Chen has been exhibiting his series, Crystal Flight, at his gallery on the Jaffa port. For me, it was like a present. It was a present. When I start working on the crystals, I flew with it. I flew and fly, and it's, it was amazing for me. And that's how I feel, and that's I want that people that come to this exhibition uh, will feel. Here we can see Jaffa. And here we can see the Western Wall and uh, all Jerusalem. He's also created a series literally from holy ground. These sculptures and designs are inscribed directly on discarded pieces of Jerusalem stone from next to the Western Wall. I'm taking a gold from 21 karat and I'm putting inside the stone after I relief it. And inside the art over here we can see a, a lat stone. A lat stone it's a kind of crystal. You see all the hearts and the energy inside our heart. Wow. And unlike most museums, here at Chen's Gallery, children and adults alike are invited to touch and feel the crystals, to take in the healing and invigorating energy of this priceless gift from nature. <laughs>